With Nuendo 14, we introduce the new AI-powered speech-to-text feature. This will transcribe your dialogue tracks into ADR markers. This cutting-edge tool uses a machine learning model to recognize and transcribe speech, saving you hours of work. Let's have a look at the dialogue transcription interface. First of all, we've got three modes of transcription. The fast model will work the quickest, and the balanced and accurate will increase accuracy but increase the transcription time. It should be noted that the balanced and accurate models have to be downloaded separately using the Steinberg Download Assistant. And once they've been downloaded, Nuendo must be restarted. Next, we have the source channel. The source channel will be the channel that we want to transcribe. And if there are multiple edited tracks that represent the dialogue, make sure they are summed into a group channel, for example. As you can see here, we would select all dialogue. And here is where we choose the marker options. The option to add transcription to selected markers can be chosen here. This function will write the transcription into existing markers. These markers must cover the time range of the Audible dialog. We also have the option to add new markers for each sentence. This function will create new markers with the transcribed dialog inside. And we can also use the drop-down list to choose our marker track. And finally, the marker attribute area is where we tell Nuendo where to put the transcription. This would usually be the dialogue column, but you can select any of the usual ADR marker attributes. So let's see dialogue transcription in action. Here we have two characters delivering some dialogue with some sound effects. Let's have a quick listen. Hello, can I help you? Hello, do you mind if I have a look around your studio? Hmm, no problem. Come on in and I'll show you some of the things going on here. The first thing we're going to do is put the left and right locators at each edge of the dialogue. Now we'll bring up the dialogue transcription tool. We'll select the balanced model for this and the source channel will be all dialogue. We'll use the add new marker for each sentence option and we'll select the marker track as VO markers. The marker attribute which will be written to the ADR will be dialogue. And now we simply press the button to start the transcription. You can see here that we now have new markers for each sentence of the speech. And if we bring up the ADR panel, you can see that the dialogue has been transcribed and has been imported into the dialogue area of the ADR markers. We can also look at this on a video screen. Hello, can I help you? Hello, do you mind if I have a look around your studio? Hmm, no problem. Come on in and I'll show you some of the things going on here. So here's another example of how we can use this in an ADR project. We can use the Add Transcription to Selected Markers option to easily enable us to enter character names and transcription into our ADR. Let's see how this works. Before we start, we need to make sure that the track names contain the character names. Then we'll select the dialogue. Now we'll use Nuendo's Create Markers from Selected Events to populate the character attribute with the track name. And we'll add this to the active marker track. And now if we look at the ADR panel, we can see that the character name has been placed in the character column. Next, we'll do the transcription for each of the pieces of dialogue separately. We'll select first, fill voice. We'll add a transcription to selected markers. And we'll make sure that only the markers that contain Phil's voice are selected. The marker attribute will still be dialogue. Then we'll repeat the process. We'll make sure that only the markers containing the minion voice are selected and we'll add transcription to selected markers again. And now when we bring up the ADR panel, we can see that the existing markers that already contain the character name also now contain the transcribed dialogue. In Uendo 14, there's also been a number of improvements to the ADR overlay. The video window in Nuendo can now display any attribute available for ADR sessions. So let's have a quick look at some of the options. Here we can choose the main overlay, which will be our dialogue. And then in the top, we'll select our character name. We'll also increase the text size 
and we'll make the text color green. We'll also disable the time code for this example. Now let's have a look. Hello, can I help you? Hello, do you mind if I have a look around your studio? Hmm, no problem. Come on in and I'll show you some of the things going on here. And finally, the new word wrap feature means that word wrap used in the dialogue text marker attribute will be displayed accordingly on the video window text overlay. As you can imagine, there are many ways that these new features in Nuendo 14 can help to improve your project workflow. And that concludes our introduction to Nuendo 14's new dialogue transcription feature and the ADR overlay improvements. Thanks for watching.